Hello everybody and welcome back to Analog Vernacular. Today we're going to be playing some more Baldur's Gate 3 and uh, we're going to finish clearing out this area of goblins. So, there's going to be some over here that we're going to have to fight. We're not in the greatest spot. Uh, Shadowheart is completely out of spell slots, but otherwise we have some options. I, mean, I should have started sneaking earlier, but that's okay. You picked the wrong fight, friend. Get okay, that's all right. Let's hope some of them slip on the way through. <laughs> okay. Well, mission accomplished. On the move. You're gonna fire on, buddy. Figuring it out. Weighing his options. Over there. Okay, worth a shot. Worth a second shot. The blade will not bend. Coming through. Path interrupted. All right, put them both. It's the best you can do. Damn, knock down that whole thing, huh? Okay. Oh, it's no longer ice. Why'd you dash? I don't think you had to dash, bro. Oh, he had to use his movement to get up. He was prone. That's why. Okay, there's that fairy fire. <laughs> gonna ruin your day, bro. Should add it. Oh no! I I think the smite is probably a bonus action anyway, so never mind. Oh, you're dead. Good. I know just what to do. Cover me! I'm going for the alarm, <laughs> buddy. I don't know how to tell you this. <laughs> They're all fucking dead. <laughs> all of them. Shouldn't have made me your enemy. I love how many options Analog has. Like she can do everything. What a great class. Like druids are crazy. finished. Okay, lost our symbiotic. So it takes an action and a bonus action, and it seems to be grayed out. I'm guessing you can't do it while you are... Okay, it's probably the these yellow ones. You get to choose one or the other. So when I'm frenzied, I can't do this and vice versa. But hey, that just means that we have one extra thing that we can do even if we don't have a frenzy charge. Okay. 
Okay. That's okay. Close ranks. On the victor's path. Coming through. It is what it is. Can't hit them all. Bro can't figure out what to do. That was weird. May the gods take you first. Oh, are you you're wearing the electrified well it, one of the two of you is. Probably you. Does that affect us as well? Like can I be electrified? In the back. Yeah, the water sparkers. Huh. Alright, well if it ends up um harming it's us rather than helping us. Happens. Maybe we'll take those off. Okay, it can hurt us. Maybe I don't want that then. Got to move. Too hard to control that situation, you know? Damn, you got movement too. Who else is alive? Where the fuck are you guys? Oh, they're up that pathway. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> this is my time. Making my move. Gone now, but he's leaving behind a trail of electricity. Not loving that. Okay, you don't have to lose your frenzy. I was a little bit worried. Well done. One, two. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Far away. Need to find a way forward.
Too far and path interrupted. I think behind that tree, they picked a nice spot for themselves, haven't they? Damn, that tree. It'd be much faster to kill him than to take out his warg. Or not. Wow. Good damage, my man. Under their noses. Handy. I need to pay attention if I'm able to recover those javelins. <coughs> Oh, so close. Blood follows me everywhere. Just some real unlucky rolls. Have to keep going. Okay. Damn it. Battle favors the fearless. You picked like the perfect spot there. You can hit us, but we can't seem to hit you. It's really quite a rude thing to do. This is gonna feel good. Jimmy on the go. Probably gonna do another long rest. The pride of the gate. Keeping pace. This better be good. Look at that, javelins. Some of the ones that hit and some of the ones that didn't. And we threw one up here too, didn't we? Yeah, let's go get that too. Hell yeah, dude. Alright, now he's encumbered. Okay, so is it Shadowheart's turn? I think it might be Shadowheart's turn. <laughs> All right. There is work to do. On I go. Better take a peek. Alright, I'm gonna have to do some major inventory management soon. We've got things all over the place right now.
right, I think we're done. I think we are done. Let's go and check and see if going underneath that windmill is actually a thing. Um, I need a long rest. And I need a major selling sesh. I'll give it a try. Oh, would you look at that? Yeah, we totally missed this. Let's see what we have here. The speedy light feet. When the wearer dashes or takes a similar action during combat, they gain three lightning char charges. Cool. Smoke powder satchel. Little bomb. Less grabbing. We do need more bags. So you're gonna take that whole bag. Okay. Let's sort by type real quick. Those can go to camp. There's probably a bunch of stuff that didn't properly get marked. need to get sent to Carlock. Okay. Sorry, but you gotta be on top. Can't give up it's the now. only right way to do it. These boots have seen everything. Does it matter? No. But I'm doing it that way anyway. <laughs> Just the way it's gotta be. Okay, looks like uh, they're getting ready to go. Zevlo, by Dell's virtue, the Blade of Frontiers. What's happened, Will? Oh, he hasn't seen I him since the, the horns. price of angering the wrong devil. Believe me, I understand better than most. A moment passes as Zevlo contemplates Will's words. He then turns his attentions to you. A scout just reported the Goblin's leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. 
Sure, we'll take it. Thank you. It's not enough, but it's all we have. Hal Sin will likely want I'm to not thank turn you it down. too, mind. He returned just a while ago. I believe he's catching up with Korga. <laughs> As for us... No armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. Oh, hell yeah. Yep, we'll see you there. I have something to ask. That's it. We can head to the city. Don't know about you, but I'm ready to start my life again. Okay. So, we'll have to see if the shopkeeper's still down here, but if he isn't, we still have one more shop with the, um... Remember, the weird mercenary the group. The group all right? What are no they called? The Zarentim or something like that? Um, at least we haven't angered them yet. We'll see how that lasts, Hell's but... didn't want us. And those druids sure as hell didn't either. But you... You risked your life for us. What do you think of opening a cart in Baldur's Gate? Uh, we made it somehow. Now we just need to get to Baldur's Gate. I like her getup. I want that getup. I need to find those clothes. Those clothes are cool. I'm your Lubbox. Yes, you are. Now, stop if there's fighting. You run and you do God, it seems we might actually make it to the city now. Hope the neighbors are a bit more welcoming. Oh, where'd your girl go? <laughs> She's gone. Thank you. Truly. You've given us a chance. We'll make good on it. You do good work. If you can handle more than goblins, might be I'll have use of you in Baldur's Gate. I don't have the idol you were after. Way would have made life a lot easier. All of our take. Yes? I've got places to be. I'm sure you do too. Always a deal to be done, even now. She's actually got some money. Damn. Okay. Try not to die up there. What's this? Should Matt, this is in more giant. interesting times. Waste of effort hauling it with us. No, there's collectors in the city. They'll pay good coin for us. I knew this would come right if we just stayed positive. Not that your blade didn't help, too. But the road would not be the same without them. Thank you. Let us go! I wish to feel the road beneath my hooves. Taste the fresh grass. Okay. One sorrow ended, the next soon to begin. Damn, a little bit more positivity. Uh, how's Arabella doing? You holding Baldur's up? Baldur's Gate, we're coming. If we get there and you're 
stealing stuff again. I swear, girl. We didn't die today. Tomorrow, perhaps, but not today. Thanks to you. Come on. We couldn't have held them back on our own. Thank you. I'm your lover. Okay, the shopkeeper's yes. still here as well. Good. So it's true. You scattered the goblins. Peace can finally return to this corner of the Sword Coast. Thank you. Just glad I could help. As am I. And I'm sure those poor refugees would quite agree. Let's trade. Of course. Insufficient gold. You know what? Let's go into barter. Um, hold on. For stacks, do I have any more stacks? If I hold shift, control. I want to see if there's a way without double. Like when I double click, I just wanted to grab the whole stack. I guess I can drag it. We know that that works, but... Okay. To throw damage. Honestly, that might be good on Carlock now, so... Now that I know about that throwing feature... So we'll take that ring. It's probably all we want, really. Okay, he's got 77 left. have to. May you keep balance. Still breathing, despite everything. Okay, so are all the refugees out of here now? I think so. I think so. Now, the blacksmith... He was over there with the refugees. I could go and see if he still will barter. Let's see, was he... You know... Maybe he wasn't with them. Bro, just talk to him. Stay safe out there. Yeah, yeah. not him. Remember, they don't need it. Near the center of the group, all right? No wandering off. What's inside? I'm a monster. Right. All of our patriots dashed away for the journey. Uh, we did it. Long, okay. Come on. Better be sure. Give me a kiss. Oh, the strange ox. Still here. Moo. Yeah, moo. Mm-hmm. Don't burn yourself. Something's up. Moo! I still can't do anything about it. No one stopped me yet. Um, the girl who... Never wanted the easy path. Did we ever actually go in here? I don't think we did. Yeah, we never actually went in there. I don't think that girl is still sitting in there. 
Okay. The pride of the gate. I'll see what I can do. So normally there would be a girl in here who like had some curse on her or something. She was like paralyzed and she would be like, you have to get out. And she'd get mad if you didn't leave cabinet key. Draw poison. Soul coins, a treatise. Academic disclosure. This research was funded independently and conducted in a site in Avernus, the first plane of the Nine Hells. Candlekeep does not encourage or promote the entrapment of mortal souls. Soul coins as a concept are one... I still haven't used one of those with our girl. I keep on forgetting that's a thing. Uh, are one of merciless simplicity. The sum of personal and magical essence, the soul, is bound into a minted piece of infernal iron and used as currency by devils in their cohort. They are frequently traded for their value can purchase mercenaries magical items, and even fuel the strange engines in the hells. However, there is a fascinating culture surrounding soul coins as well. I spoke to a devil who admitted she has one coin that she will never sell, for it was the bargain that got her promoted out of Lemur's status. She connected me to a half-elf warlock who had promised his soul coin, his soul to a coin after death. I was able to look at his contract, which is reproduced below. The next 50 pages appear to be a painstakingly written legal document in Infernal, with a headache-inducing number of footnotes. Let's have a look. Druid's Ledger. Supply log is scrawled and underlined on the inside cover. The dirt stained pages that follow track the storage and use of food and medical supplies. A flurry of entries near the end suggests that the reserves are nearly depleted. According to all these empty boxes, there is definitely, obviously, some truth to that. Don't mind if I do. I have never seen these scenes because once again um, my game was weird and everybody was already gone when I came back here I think I had a bug so Oop, he's interacting with Kaga I wonder if this could end up being a fight though you, you don't took it upon yourself have a lot to of resources the right of thorns I ought to exile you from this place forever instead I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence. The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay, but consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again right here. Backslide and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish. 
Master Halcyon. Damn, demoted. Put in her place. Honestly, she's kind of monstrous. Yeah, she was awful. Is such a mercy why she strayed from your teachings once already? She knows now what cavorting in the shadows brings her. She will not stray again. Besides, this is no time to lose a promising druid. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The grove stands. Nature prevails. And again, I am in your debt. Speak to Wrath. He will reward you for your efforts. Okay. Um, if she had killed that kid, I would I would have to insist on something more for her. But since that since we were able to help that kid get away, um, I'm willing to see where that goes. I would not be okay with this if she had killed that kid, though. The grove is nature's beating heart. I was glad to help save it. If only you had come to this place in more peaceful times. You'd have been a welcome addition. So, what about my problem? I do need some help. Tomorrow morning, we shall discuss what is to come. Okay. Banished. Then banish me. When the coming army marches, there will be none to protect you. No, I, I need to talk to Kaga. I need Peace. to tell her off. Enjoy it while it lasts. <laughs> Bitch. Bitch. Your 84 health can be downed real quick if I want it to. Okay? With the leadership dead, no attack will be mounted on the grove. I am in your debt, my friend. Tell me what you know about getting to Moonrise. Soon. First, I must set matters to rights in the Grove. And you should celebrate your victory. After being dormant for so long, your infection is unlikely to produce new symptoms spontaneously. Tomorrow morning, we shall discuss what is to come. What happens next? The journey to Moonrise Towers. And all the dangers that that entails. But that's tomorrow's problem. Take some time for yourself tonight. Rest. Celebrate. Come morning, I'll be by your side. Okay. You know, I could still probably still this. Now that there's not a... Well, I guess they're kind of looking at it, aren't they? Uh, God, we never learn. You kind of want to steal it for, uh, for the, for those kids. But that also feels kind of wrong, especially with Halson back. Like, it's his idol. I, th I think we'll leave it. I think we'll leave it be. I certainly want to, though. that bear still down there? He is. Let's go tell him. Halson's back. He's back! You brought him back! I did bring him back. Alright, he's happy. That's all I needed. A little bit of serotonin. <laughs> You guys feel bad for what you did? Things are starting to calm down, thanks to you. We can finally get some rest. We'll be I hear the goblin leaders met their ends. Unfortunate for them, but very fortunate for the Grove. Yeah, you can thank me. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Still sleeping. Okay, buddy. How about this one? You're curious. 
You've got a great many odors about you. What happened to you? <laughs> Lots. Tell him about the intrigues of the Underdark and how you ended up there. He listens, up rapt, here. hanging on every word. As you near the end of your tale, you see his attention drift as he licks his lips, thinking about something else entirely. I know you stopped the goblins, but I can't stop looking over my shoulder. It makes it hard to sleep at night. God, everyone in this game is gorgeous. Uh, hey, I brought Halson back. He's gonna find well, you a mate. The sun is nice. You should try it. Lay down and bask in its warmth. I wasn't sure about you at first. Thought you might be trouble. I was very wrong. Damn right. We're free of the goblins, but the grove is changed. Wounded. The days ahead won't be easy. I'm glad we have Halsin to guide us. Yes! Yes! This is perfect! Nah. Bird gets to keep his little treasure trove. I've probably unlocked whatever so much anger. that key unlocks anyway. We have to let it go. There goes nothing. Okay, Wrath. I was told you, you had a reward. It. You brought House in back. Thank you. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. Think nothing of it. I'm glad Halson is safe. As am I. The grove will be whole again. And I promised you a reward, didn't I? Let me show you on your map where you can find the cache. Take this rune. You'll need it. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. Oh. When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below will be yours. Cool. Well, all right then. Let's go get that. Blessed day. I was worried I'd never see Master Halson again. You kept your word. Thank you. You're very welcome. I don't know if I can ever restore Sylvanus's peace to this place, but I'll have the chance. Thanks to you. Hey, the bird she was helping is flying now. Wing's still a little stiff. But I'm getting stronger. Oh, good for you, little guy. <gasps> There's a portrait of Losa. From DOS 2. Aw, oh, Losa's fantastic. Oh, I love Losa. Fane, Losa. Um, yeah, let's see. Fane, Losa. Who was my party? Those two were definitely in it. Uh, Sibyl. And... And my main character. Yeah, that was my party. I'm gonna have to play that on... On channel again sometime. Not again, because I never have. Um, when I played that game, I didn't actually have a channel at the time, so... Um, alright. Inventory. Sort by latest. Rune of the Wolf. Well, well, what have we here? Now, we never 
figured out how to open this, so who opened this? At least I don't think we did. I thought that we had to walk away from that. Ooh, secret societies? I want to read that. The Harpers, the most well-known of the Sword Coast Cabals, perhaps, but certainly not benign in its shrouded doings. My sources claim that those belonging to this mysterious faction abhor power. But if that is so, why do they not expose the revelations of their inquiries for the public good? Why indeed, because knowledge is power and the Harpers intend to keep both for themselves. Shadow Druids Weigh the life of a man against that of a sapling oak. Which do you value more highly? Ask a Shadow Druid the selfsame question and be shocked by their answer. This dangerous group utterly disregards intelligent life in favor of the life of plants and insects. Their perversion of the natural order leads them to plan and execute plots so dastardly that the mere description of one would leave you glancing sideways at your begonias. The Order of Clerd, the least known and accordingly most dangerous of the secret societies I have researched is the Order of Clerd. My sources tell me this shadowy conspiracy of murderers, mutilators, and tyrants regularly meet to plan the demise of any number of innocent citizens of our fair land. What's more, they like it. The Dark Justiciers. I shudder even to inscribe their name upon the purity of this page. I shall leave it at this. They worship Shar. So yeah, like worshiping Shar in this world is basically like Satanism. And I guess when I say that, um... It doesn't really apply to the Satanists that we kind of see in America today, because they aren't really kind of what... Yeah, and you know, we don't even need to get into it. It's not the same thing. I take it back. <laughs> Robe of Summer. Resistance to cold damage. Okay, that could be for Gale. Sorrow, a two-handed glaive. Has extra reach. 1d10. Sorrowful Lash. Pulls the creature three meters closer to you. And 1d4 plus three piercing damage. I don't think this, yeah, staff or club it wouldn't work for a glaive. A beautiful glaive. So why does touching it give me a knot in my stomach? That is a good question. So a glaive is a marshal, but Shadowheart could use it. But it's two-handed, isn't it? We'll check if it's versatile. If it, I think it, I think vers somebody correct me, but versatile I think means that it can be two-handed or one-handed. Is that true? Like a lot of spears are that way. So Will can use glaives, but don't think we'll be doing that. And you can use glaives, but you have much power, much more powerful things at your disposal. No time to waste. Yeah, damn. Okay. If we want her to be a um, a shield user, then I think she just has to have really low damage. Um, 
I don't know if clerics ever get any kind of feats that will give them proficiencies in other weapons. Actually, we know that they're like there are feats that can do that, right? So maybe what we need to do is next time she has a feat available, give her proficiency with um some other other weapon types, some martial weapon types. Yeah, I don't know. A druid note. The Emerald Enclave won't send help even if I ask. This land is wounded and the rot is deep, but it's deep everywhere. I can't wait to help uh, for help to come, but perhaps I need not face the darkness alone. Looking ahead. With haste. To not be cursed. But that will fit in my bag. Might be useful. Oh, <laughs> I was like, what voice is that? It's the guardian. It was the our guardian just told us to do that. That counted as one of the special ones. Did we ever read this? Extraordinary happenings while meditating in the forest. Nettie and I were ambushed by a pack of goblins led by a dro. We had no choice but to defend ourselves, but that is not the extraordinary or rather disturbing part. On the Drow's death, a parasitic creature emerged from the corpse and attempted to escape. I managed to capture it and have the host's cadaver here in my study. I've told no one of my fears. Nettie suspects, but knows better than to ask. I will investigate further before informing the others. Kaga will demand answers I don't yet have. I had better record any further findings in a separate volume and keep them upon my person. Lest prying eyes jump to the wrong conclusions. Yeah, I think we did read those. Uh, Pace is returning to the grove. Oh, we have you to thank for that. Seems like a good moment to talk. Master Halcid's home. I think it's high time you all left. Our sacred grove has sheltered you enough. You suck, dude. Do not presume to speak for this place, not when you did nothing to defend it. I answer to Sylvanus, and Sylvanus only. And you are not the Oak Father. You did this grove a great favor. And now leave the rest to us. Okay, so Kaga and this guy are the ones to look out for, huh? Peace. The wolf focuses on you, calmed in your presence. It might be time for another. I'm no fan of those devils either. These are but cool. They're leaving. If it had been up to Kolga, these are really cool. Never have been here at all. Okay, I'm assuming that the girl who is playing music is probably with all the other refugees, but I'm just going to go up there and check. Yep, she's gone. Cool.
she sell stuff? Thanks to you. Thanks to you, we have the nope. chance to heal. Barter's grayed out. Okay, that's fine. All right, well, it might be time to go to camp. Sounds like we're going to have a bit of a party. To celebrate our big win. Okay. Hey, nobody's here. What's inside? Maybe we'll loot this place dry at some point, but for now, let's leave it be. Like, we got some breastplates and stuff over here. Ooh, these ones are free. from a soothsayer. Very well. Seems simple enough. What's in here? Magic touch. Still alive, so that's progress. Zentarim. That's um. Here we go. That's that group that we uh, ran into. Perhaps greater still than their monopoly is the continent's largest private army. The true achievement of the modern Zentarim is in the sanitized image they present to the world. Viewed by most as an efficient, if unscrupulous, mercenary organization, few would guess at the Black Network's dark origin as a cult dedicated to the dark god Bane, once bent towards bringing all people to heal beneath its creed of tyranny and domination. Many among their ranks scoff when confronted with this fact, citing overblown conspiracies and reassuring me that the only gods to whom the Zentarum give worship today are the twin deities Prophet and Power. This is not to say that the organization has entirely shed its dark side, however. Alongside the clenched fist of their military, another hand works from the shadows to ensure that the network prospers even in peacetime. For just as vital as the movements of troops is the movement of goods, legal or otherwise, and there is no border or market that is ever truly closed to one bearing the sale of the Black Network. On my way. Alright. I think we're gonna go to camp. 
So, this is where we're going to end this episode, so thank you all for being here. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode where we go to party. Hell yeah. Bye, everybody. I'd like to give a very special shout out to my patron supporters, Darren York, ZTD, Knife Namase, Kyle the Monarch, Andrew Smith, Chris Murphy, JW, Quinless, Chris Smith, Vlada 101, Andy Ford, Angel Mejia, Black Mamba 90, Eureka Gecko, A Happy Fat Panda, and Kyle Schluter. If you would also like to join this tier or any others, check out my memberships or my Patreon in the description down below.